Doctor in Islam and Humanity. Good afternoon. We are here, here in a uh, rest area on a motorway, and uh, there are our Bangladeshi brother, Pakistani brother. We are together for the Rohingya Muslim. We stand uh, together here. अभी वो अब आप जो उर्दू में उर्दू में हमें देख रहे हैं फेसबुक पर अल्हम्दुलिल्लाह कि देखें कि वो मीर ने कहा था कि खंजर चले किसी पे तड़पते हैं हम अमीर सारे जहां का दर्द हमारे जिगर में है यहां पर रंगों नस्ल को बलाए ताक रखते हुए इंसानियत की खातिर और रोहिंग्यन मुसलमानों के साथ इजारे यकजहती की खातिर बांग्लादेशी भाई हमारे साथ खड़े हैं पाकिस्तानी भाई हमारे साथ खड़े हैं जी Mufti Abdullah Sahib, our friend, is here. Uh, Inshallah, uh, we are together here. We are on our way to London. We know the purpose. We are going for our brothers and sisters. They are getting chopped off live. They are, they are being slaughtered live. We are going for, to support them, to, to, help, to help them. It's our responsibility. Uh, this is for our human force we are going for. So we, we are just going to help them and support them. Hope this helps for the human issue, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum wa wabarakatuh. MashaAllah, this is a blessed day for us all Muslims that we can today voice our concerns over what is happening in Burma today. You know, as a cause for humanity, Islam teaches us that we stand as one, we stand as united. And this is one of the peaceful ways that we can protest about all the atrocities that are happening in Burma. You know, you don't have to raise your sword, you don't have to raise it, you can raise your voice and raise your concerns. You know, Allah has given us, blessed us with the health and wealth and everything. You know, there are so many ways that we can help our brothers. Alhamdulillah, you know, from Hansworth, all the brothers of all communities have come together with Masjid Aisha, and they are here today representing Masjid Aisha, and we are going to London to raise our concerns about what is happening. And, you know, I urge all the Muslims who are listening to this, you know, you can help in so many different ways. Please do so. Allah has blessed us with so many things. You know, we don't have to go down to the protest. We can help it financially. We can help with the du'as. You know, du'as is the most important thing. You know, get up for the uh, hajjud. Read to the garden of You know, pray for the brothers. May du'a, may du'a for all the brothers here today. Alhamdulillah, jazakallah. In Bangladeshi language. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Amara Shabai Dekhrato, Ayyuh Koyak Tindagi Kura Renguniyat, Arkano Deo Bosta, Musulman De Kora, or Ita Emuna Bosta, Musulman De Kora, or the Jailiyat or Zubana Taki, Aro Beshi, Rave Kora, or Manshore, Mara, or Bajanture Mara, or Khani Maze, Bout Dia, Bout Mapari Di Trausum, or Mar Armiya Gullyukuri Mare, Abnar. How can we sleep in our beds when our brothers and sisters, our mothers, and our fathers have been slaughtered, slaughtered, genocide, ethnic cleansing. How can we sleep? What face will we give to Allah on the day of Qiyamah? What answers will we give when Allah will ask us? What did you do to protect? What did you do to raise your voice for those who have been killed? My brothers and sisters, remember us in your dua. We must not, we must not let this happen. We must stop this genocide. If you cannot do anything physically, then you must do it with du'as. Ask Allah to actually guide all of humanity and in, in, inshallah guide the Muslim Ummah to be one Ummah. Jazakallah khair. واشتد عداء المعتدين واشتد عداء المعتدين وازداد اذى المجرمين يا ربي انت رب المستضعفين يا ربي يا against the, this genocide with the Rohingya where everyone where announced to the whole world where Muslim unity and hadith of the Prophet if one part of Muslim
muslim is hurt so affected to other this is likewise body our body were hurt in hand so feel all over the body so everyone is sad and we so much hurt everyone try to genocide with the muslim especially in the rohingya philistine bosnia kashmir where everyone try to say everyone where everyone unity and you need to stop the, this type of the genocide. Exactly. is killed, then nobody cares. But when anyone else is even attacked, then the whole world actually rises up. Sanctions are put on countries. Look how many Muslim countries have got sanctions against them. For what? For what? Why is there no sanction against Myanmar? Why is it? Why is it that no one cares? And we as Muslims are getting worked out that we want to remove the Ansan Sushi's Nobel Peace Prize. If we remove that, she will become the rest of us. We should campaign.